wanna take it all in. I'm falling. The cityscape by night. Wanna catch my photos. Where you go? Every corner twice as bright. There'll be my treasures forever. When I can't hold you tight, I'll see the Stockholm lights. The Stockholm lights. The Stockholm lights. Hello, everybody. In this video, I will try to make some face mask which can possibly kill some coronavirus. Uh, coronavirus is really, really nasty virus which can stick to almost any surface and also can survive for many, many hours. And that's why I search on the internet what can kill some coronavirus. And I read many articles which claim that the temperature of uh, 56 degrees C can kill coronavirus. So that's why I get the idea, what if I can make a face mask which can be heated on uh, 56 degrees C. So I don't know if this can actually work, but I just try to think outside the box. But yeah, I will try to make this heated face mask. Uh, this or something similar to this one, the face masks are used by medical workers uh, for respect and the medical workers are in direct contact uh, with people which have coronavirus. And yeah, big respect. Uh, so anyway, I will try to make this project uh, to see what I will get out from it so this is some typical face mask and here I cut some section of the face mask to get this fiber uh, fiber like material and on this uh, material I will make some heater to make a heater For the heating material, I will use this ink. Um, this ink is water-based ink and don't have any any danger materials. So this one is really safe. For the electrodes, I will use two copper strips. Uh, these two copper strips I will add on the each side, and then I will paint everything with conductive ink. First of all, I will put some conductive ink on each side that the copper will stick very well to this fiber material. Great. Jeans or shirt or two 
Take it all in. I'm falling. The cityscape by night. I'm gonna get you my fall. And now I have these two electrodes in place. And now I will paint everything. And now I will try and I will see what I get. The heater is dry. I make two coatings of the conductive ink and I also connect these two cables. With these two cables I will connect this mask to the power supply. This heater I will not add on this mask but on this one. something like this uh, I don't know maybe I will make something like this something like sandwich that the heater is between so the mask the base of the mask heater and the top layer so basic the mask is ready uh, to make this mask I use some ordinary mask for the base material then I attach some heater uh, and on the top I put the second mask to cover the heater but now I have this mask uh, connected to my power supply to see if I can get uh, this temperature uh, for this mask I also need some power bank uh, with 12 volts and some potential matter which you can regulate uh, the temperature uh, but right now I have connected this mask to my power supply to see what I will get so the temperature right now is 14 degrees C So I start my power supply.
right now I put in uh, 10 volts and almost 1 amp. I will increase the power a little bit. To 11 volts. Fifty-seven degrees Sixty. So I need to decrease the voltage a little bit. So this mask right now is okay, but I need to try it by myself uh, if I can use this mask for, I don't know, one hour uh, on 60 degrees C. Oh, I need to lower the voltage a little bit. So 10 volts will be fine. And yeah, now I will test this mask. Uh, after around 30 minutes, I have this mask on my face. And I can say that uh, to having this mask on the face is not so bad, after all. Uh, it's a little bit warm, but this is okay. If this mask can kill coronavirus, then everything is okay. Uh, so what is the temperature? It's around 60 degrees C. So the temperature is 60 degrees C. Uh, and I run this mask below 10 volts. If I make better heater, uh, I can also run this mask with uh, some power bank for phones on 5 volts and yeah we see us in the next video be safe I wanna take it all in I'm falling the cityscape by night wanna catch in my photos where you go every corner twice as bright there'll be my treasures forever when I can't hold you tight I'll see the star call